An argument over a pair of sneakers led to a man getting stabbed to death outside a dispensary in Ontario yesterday. Police Chief Stephen Romero says this was related to gang violence. These are the two suspects in custody, both from Nampa, arrested there last night for the murder. Joey Prechtel spent the day in Ontario. He's in studio now to tell us the details. Joey. Well, Mark, police confirmed today that this man, Jonah Reyes, was the victim. This was a picture of him at his old job, Looks New Car Wash, in Ontario. They, they extended their condolences to the Reyes family on Facebook, saying he was a hard worker and thanked him for his dedication to them. It's been more than 24 hours after the fatal stabbing outside this dispensary in Ontario, Oregon. And Jonah Reyes is being remembered for his smile and work ethic. He was a really good kid. I mean... He was like my little brother I had, didn't know I had. We clicked right away and just became really good friends. This is Frankie Bailey Jr. He worked with Reyes at Looks New Car Wash in town. I send my condolences and prayers to the family. He's going to be greatly missed. As for what led up to the stabbing, police say an argument on tennis shoes started all of it. What we believe it to be was what we call gang banging. Police Chief Stephen Romero says Reyes was quote, calling out to one of the suspects, Gerardo Lopez, about his shoes and what gang he belonged to. That led to some other types of arguing and insulting one another. After the argument, Reyes went outside and police say he was met by the two suspects. Chief Romero says Lopez then assaulted Reyes, then Luis Duran stabbed him. Uh, in this particular incident, it was a random crime. You, you have two individuals that met at, at a location just by chance and it was just a bad situation that went really bad. Both men were arrested in Nampa Sunday night and they're awaiting extradition to Oregon. I'm still of the opinion that our city is a very safe community and it is you know, pretty free of criminal gang activity uh, at this point. I just hope the person that's responsible for this owns up to their actions because they took somebody's son, a brother, and a family member that was minding their own business. Both Lopez and Duran are facing murder and assault charges. The Ontario Police Department needs to file a case with the grand jury and the district attorney in Oregon, then get warrants to bring the two suspects back to Ontario to start that court process. Mark? All over a pair of shoes. Yes, yeah, it really.